Are you looking for ways to resolve workplace conflict as a manager? Consider a risk assessment. Several factors should be considered when conducting a risk assessment to reduce violence in the workplace and conflict. These factors help identify potential risks and vulnerabilities within the workplace. And here are some key elements to include in a risk assessment. Number one, physical environment. Assess the workplace's layout, design, and security features. Consider access control, surveillance systems, lighting, and emergency exits. Identify areas with risks or vulnerabilities, such as secluded or poorly monitored spaces. Two, workforce characteristics. Evaluate the composition of the workforce, including the number of employees, their roles, and the level of interaction or stress associated with their positions. Consider factors such as diversity, cultural differences, and potential sources of tension that may contribute to conflicts. Three, policies and procedures. Review existing policies and procedures related to workplace behavior, conflict resolution, violence prevention, and reporting mechanisms. Assess the effectiveness of these policies in addressing potential risks and conflicts. Identify any gaps or areas for improvement. Four, employee behaviors and interactions. Analyze employee behavior patterns such as signs of aggression, bullying, harassment, or conflicts among individuals or groups. Consider the nature and frequency of interactions, communication styles, and any history of previous incidents or complaints. Look for warning signs or triggers that may escalate conflicts. Five, external factors. Consider external factors that may influence workplace violence or conflicts, such as proximity to high crime areas, social unrest, or other environmental risks. Evaluate the potential impact of these external factors on the workplace and its employees. Six, training and awareness. Assess the adequacy and effectiveness of training programs related to conflict resolution, de-escalation techniques, diversity and inclusion, and identifying early warning signs of violence. Determine whether employees have the necessary knowledge and skills to prevent and respond to potential incidents. Seven, organizational culture. Evaluate the prevailing organizational culture and its impact on workplace dynamics. Consider whether the culture promotes respect, open communication, and support. Assess the alignment between the stated values and actual behaviors within the workplace. Previous number eight, previous incidences and near misses. Review records of past incidents, near misses, or reports of workplace conflict or violence. Analyze these incidents' patterns, causes, and outcomes to identify common risk factors and areas for improvement. Nine, communication channels. Evaluate the effectiveness of communication channels within the organization. Assess whether employees feel comfortable reporting concerns, conflicts, or potential risks. Consider the confidentiality and anonymity of reporting mechanisms and the responsiveness of management to employee concerns. 10. Industry and sector specific risks. Risks. Identify any specific risks or challenges associated with the industry or sector in which the organization operates. Factors such as high stress environments, client interactions, or exposure to volatile situations may require additional risk mitigation measures. By thoroughly assessing these factors, organizations can understand the potential risks and vulnerabilities related to workplace internet, interpersonal conflict. This knowledge, is, knowledge allows them to develop targeted strategies and preventive measures to minimize these risks and foster a safer work environment. Look, if you're looking for ways to reduce workplace conflict or increase employee engagement and organizational performance, then take the Workforce Alchemy Challenge at workforcealchemy.com. Apply to participate in the challenge. Gain expert knowledge for free and earn up to $1,000 worth of tools to help your business or department run better and faster without unnecessary drama or expense. Apply for the Workforce Alchemy Challenge again at workforcealchemy.com.